Okay, hey guys, so I just want to do a quick video on my indoor garden. I brought in uh, some pepper plants from the out or from the greenhouse. Uh, I brought some uh, romaine lettuces in, and I've got my little grapefruit tree back here that I started last spring. So the pepper plants are doing okay. Uh, I've got a little bit of aphid problem though when I brought them inside. I guess they had laid their eggs in the soil and they're all over my plants. You can see the holes in them here. Um, I've been trying to kill them, crushing them with my fingers and I've been doing a spray with some olive oil, some uh, dish soap and water spraying it but that doesn't seem to be helping. So I think next year what I will do if I transplant my peppers from outside to indoors, I will shake all the dirt off the roots and then I will just use my Pro Mix soil to fill it up and then it will be sterile and I won't have any problems with any bugs hopefully uh, destroying my plants here. Um, I also planted some uh, lettuces in here just to help uh, see if I can get some lettuces growing in here. Um, and I've got a chia pet, a hippo chia pet I got for Christmas a few years ago. So I've actually only done this once so I figured I'd pull them out and try them out again. And I'll show you my fruit uh, tree here. He's coming along slowly. So I've got the heat pads on him and my peppers just to help them give them a little bit of an extra boost for the winter. And I'll just show you a quick close up as well here. Oh, I should mention too as well, I'm using the Agro Bright Grow Light. I know uh, you guys are probably looking at being like John, it's an on angle, what's going on? I don't have anywhere in my house really to put it straight right now. So this is the best I can do having it on an angle. I should probably somehow hook up some kind of hooks from the top of the table so it can actually hang above the plants as opposed to an angle. But that's what I've got right now. So yeah, I'll do a quick close up on my plants here quickly for you. Okay, so here's my jalapeno plant here, pepper plant. He's got one jalapeno on him somewhere down here. Um, they're not really flowering right now. I need to get a LED light, I think, with a spectrum to uh, grow the flowering, get the flower buds going. I've got my just regular pepper plant here. These peppers were all on it in the summertime when I brought it in and it's summer. Um, the only thing is they haven't really grown much inside. They just colored up with the light. So I'm hoping uh, that they grow a little bigger. I've been adding some uh, organic fertilizer, liquid kelp fertilizer to it to help them grow a bit. And there's a few little buds I saw somewhere growing on it. But we'll see what happens. I've got uh, down here, there's some uh, little green shoots coming off the stalk here. And then I've got my romaine lettuces here. There we go. They're growing a little bit, but not much. I wasn't really expecting a whole lot indoors for these guys, but whatever. It's worth trying it out in my little plant here, my little grapefruit tree. I don't expect to get any fruit off this ever here in Canada, but you never know. So there we go, guys. I just wanted to do a quick little video for you guys to show you my little indoor garden. I'm hoping that they all survive over the winter and I can retransplant them in the springtime outside. Uh, pe peppers for sure. The lettuces will probably be uh, dead or gone by that time. So I hope you guys like that video. Please subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to hit the little red bell so you get the updates on all my videos. And wherever you are, happy gardening. And if you're in Canada or somewhere in the cold climate, northern USA, uh, hunker down, keep warm for the winter. We'll see you soon.